it's simply the J. Um, so today I actually got the snack crate, and let me tell y'all, they didn't. So if you don't know what snack crate is, it's like this thing. This um, I kind of don't even know what to, how to really explain it, but you subscribe. That's um, I think it's like twenty five to thirty five dollars, but the first subscription is five dollars. So I should have known that the snack crate was gonna be this small, but usually it's like probably like two three times bigger than this, and it's um. How do I explain it? It's where you make you get a subscription every like either the beginning of the month or the end of the month. Um, they send you a snack crate, and the snack crate is like a crate from all around the world. I wouldn't say like you just they pick a different country each time, and I really like it. I thought it was cool, and plus the people that I see, if you you know me. If the people that I see do it, it's like really fun. Like they make it really funny and it's really cool just to try different snacks all around the world to me. Um, yeah, cause I live in America and I already and I like to eat. So yeah, I'm gonna have to, I scratched most of it out so y'all can't see, but yeah. I honestly probably should've got some scissors though. This is how it looks. Oh cool, I got Korea. My sister would have loved this. Okay, so I've got Korea. The heat summer is here and that means some items can melt or get softened in warmer temperatures during transfer. Place your crate in the refrigerator. I didn't refrigerate this. But there is like my house been air conditioning, but yeah. So like it says, snap crate, really cool. I got Korea. It gives you like little booklets and stuff, stickers. Really cool. I'm telling you guys, like I know this video might not seem, but like I'm really excited because I've always wanted to do this. And I know this next subscription, I'll probably do it with a friend because I'm telling you guys, the box is probably the size of this table that like I'm using, so yeah. So it just shows you like basically fun facts about Korea and um, okay. So, and then it also shows you like what I got in the box, like the names of it. So, um, I'm trying to show you guys everything in the box before I get straight to it. They gave me a little snack crate sticker, some more snack crate stickers, and stuff. It's pretty cool. Okay, so let's get started. Ooh, I keep breaking my chair because it's like a bin and I'm a big girl. So, so this is what the packaging looks like. Really cool like the little sticker let's get started so I'm gonna take the camera and show you exactly how it starts so this is what it looks like on the inside pretty cool pretty nice okay so let's start off with the Orion Choco Pie with marshmallow filling. I will hit a kid in the throat and they're being loud. It tastes kind of like, um, Have you ever had like the chocolate swirls, like you know the full chocolate thing with the cream in the middle? It tastes like that, but the generic version. If I rate it out of one out of five, it's like a two. All right, kind of don't know what this was for. Probably. All right, let's try. What? So this is what I'll be trying. I really don't know what it's called, but it says delicious and fresh baked pie. So looks like a cracker with like strawberry jam spread out on it. It kind of looks like a toaster strudel, but like inside out. It smells good though. I'm trying to. Mm mm. No. Not from. Mm mm. Okay, they gave me two. And I don't want to try the other one. 
<laughs> it wasn't good. I mean, it, mm -mm. it just wasn't good to me. But yeah, it comes in Apple too. So this is what the packaging looks like. I'm trying to, okay, it says a biscuit and chocolate. I'm guessing it's shaped like a mushroom. So this is what it came in. So it's just the packaging and then this is like extra packaging. It's kind of melted. Now I understand why they said refrigerated. I like I don't understand why you would just put it in the packaging. Why wouldn't you put it like over it and say, hey, refrigerate but it. So Okay, so you know those things and like it comes like with Nutella and chocolate dip and like sometimes peanut butter. And it's like those little wafers that you stick in it. That's what these remind me of. This is kind of what it looks like. Like, I don't know if y'all can see. But. I mean, they melted in our thing, but this is a hit. This is a hit. This right here is a hit. I'm gonna save these for later because that's real good. Okay, now these I will be doing like another time. Oh, no, I won't. Okay. I thought I would have to boil it, but I don't. So this is called Pushu Pushu. Barbecue flavored noodle snack. And I guess you just smash the noodles, sprinkle the spice in, and shake it around. So basically, they took the ramen noodles, Put some barbecue flavor in the package. And once you crunch it up, you just eat it raw. I used to do that shit when I was little. And my mom told me to stop because I'll get worms. I don't know. I mean, I'll try it, but I don't want to get worms. I'm doing it how the bag, the bag says. I'll do it like that, so. <laughs> okay, so literally looks like ramen noodles, but it doesn't smell like ramen noodles. So it's like, you know how like ramen noodles just have that smell? Like I don't know how to explain it, but like that plain smell. It doesn't have that smell. It has more like a chippy flavor smell. You got your sauce. You gotta have a sauce. This is a sauce, so I put the sauce in. I mean, something, I mean, like, I'm cool with barbecue chips, but just something like, just they got the ramen noodle in my head, so like, I don't know about this. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, mm mm. It kind of tastes like they try to have a Pringle. Have you ever had that potato french fry place when they give you all different seasonings? I fucking hate that shit. This. Now, I think this is just like a lemon chew. Lemonade. So it's supposed to be a sour candy. Let's see. Okay, this one's South Korea. Um, Sekon Dalkong. Sour fruit chew similar to high chew from Japan. Okay, that's cool, I guess. Now, it's supposed to be really sour. The package says it's supposed to be like extra, extra sour. So, lemons looking like a grenade and shit.
It don't even taste like that. I'm over here drilling. It don't taste like that. And it's hard to fuck the chew. My motherfucking tooth about to come out. I'm not a fan. I've never really been a fan of chewy candy anyways, but not a fan. So all in all, I would have to say I basically didn't really like anything but these. These Choco Boys or Choco Boys or whatever. Fuck with them. These are a hit. Make sure you get these wherever you can. Okay, that's all for today, guys. Um, it was kind of fun. It was kind of an experience to just try all these new things. And I can't wait to actually get the bigger one. The bigger one is like the one I, I subscribed to the premium one. So that's with the drinks and stuff. So that one, I really can't wait to get one. It's going to be next month. I probably will get it. Or the end of this month. So you never know. Make sure you like and subscribe and comment below. Because, yeah, why not? I mean, you ain't got nothing better to do. My next video should be a curly hair routine. It's gonna be for me, Nova, and her dad because we all have curly hair. So it's gonna be really fun just to see like the different things we do. And yeah, so.